So this is Rob 3. He's a Rover 5 base with a four channel motor controller, uh, which can sense the, um, or it has um, four encoders, four motors, and it actually can monitor the current drain on each motor. I'm controlling it with uh, Arduino Mega. I have an XB for communications, a gyro, and an OLED for uh, display. So, oh yeah, and I also have uh, just a little servo on there just for something else to control. So we have here um, all of the encoders, drive and direction, and then I have the drive pins, sorry, direction pins, drive PWM, and to the analog I have the four current sensors. And then for a remote, I have my uh, ICE2 controller with uh, four PS2 joysticks and two rotary encoders uh, with buttons on it and uh, an OLED display as well. So let's turn on rub 3. So he's on. My controller. So on the display, sometimes hard to focus on, sorry. Okay, so I have it displaying the position of all the joysticks, so I'll display around with a couple of them. That's X and that's Y. And you can see along the uh, very edges of the screen there. Um, shows the position on the little uh, the little line bar there and position of the button. So the nice thing about the XB is I can actually have two-way communication. So I'm going to enable the robot. So he's enabled now. So. Now, whenever I change the encoder, I have that set up just to uh, for the uh, robot drive. So let's see here, you can see, oops, what are seeing on the display right now is that yeah, the robot is enabled, and the speed, um, so what's happening is uh, the joystick position and the rotary encoder is being sent um, about uh, 50 times per second, and the robot is actually sending back information on the motor, uh, or on the, the current draw of the motors, and that's the four numbers on the uh, lower right. And then speed is actually a reflection of um, what I've actually been sending it from the uh, from the encoder over here. So as I uh, increase the speed on the increase the encoder, you can see the speed on the display there is increasing, as well as the speed of the robot. You can also see you can also see the current drain on the motor is going up. And if you put a, 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 a drag on the motor, you can see the uh, current on the left hand side is a lot a lot higher. Start using the yellow joystick. 